Hey everyone, hope you're all doing well. We are on to day four of trying to get my life together and get on top of the house. And if you've seen the previous videos, you would know that I'm starting with a little bit of maintenance and touching up on the rooms that I've already cleaned. So today for me, that's the upstairs bathroom and the kids' bedroom. No one has been in the office. I didn't have anything to do in there. And when I say touching up for the bathroom, that just means quickly clean the toilet, wipe it down, wipe the basins and the tabs if you have any items out of place just put them away any dirty clothes or anything that doesn't belong in the bathroom take it away and just keep on top of it and then in the bedroom that's just making the beds again putting any items away and putting any dirty clothes in the washing basket any clean clothes where they belong i've just included that little footage of watching washing my hands um deliberately i know most people don't film it i don't always film it as well but here is your reminder if you're cleaning the toilet please 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 always thoroughly wash your hands after and this little touch up that i'm doing now the maintenance was included in the 30 days clean the clutter and organize challenge that i did and it's also part of the fly lady's morning routine it's just making the beds and she calls it swish and swipe which is basically just clean the toilet and the sink and as a messy neurodivergent person who can't clean as i go and pick up as i go this has been the only way to get on top of the house and stay on top of it and this is just a small footage of my bedroom because this is what i'll be working on today and i've started with deep cleaning uh, most of it well i've kind of separated it into sections because if you've followed my channel for a while you would know that I need to work in sections to try and focus otherwise I get very easily distracted and I also need that sense of accomplishment I know that most people would have probably started with tidying first instead of deep cleaning parts of the room but I needed to know that something has been done that I've accomplished something and I knew that going through all the laundry that I have would be a little bit more challenging and i needed to build up that momentum in order to tackle it it was also a way of my brain trying to postpone it for as long as possible so i've just started with vacuuming all over the bed the mattress making sure that the bedroom is deep cleaned properly i have done also the wardrobe wiping down all the mirrors the top of the wardrobes then i clean the windows the blinds and that's when i hit rock bottom and i had to finally face my demons and start on the clothes that are scattered all over the floor i'll be honest with you i didn't get to finish the bedroom yesterday i said i want to do the bedroom and the landing and that was very much wishful thinking i should have realized that it's way too big of a job for me to do in one day especially when the kids are off school while i was cleaning nick had taken them to the park but then i had to stop because they came back i had to spend time with them get dinner ready shower and i couldn't just spend the whole day in the bedroom i'm sure the most moms at the moment during the summer breaks can relate but i have been trying to practice progress over perfection and i'm satisfied with the fact that the bedroom is well, I left it better than when I found it. So I have managed to do quite a bit. And I know that I should hopefully, hopefully manage to finish it tomorrow and to the landing as well. But it is progress and I am sticking with doing something every day. I just have to try and fit the cleaning around the rest of my life instead of trying to fit the rest of my life around the cleaning a constant struggle for balance and i'm not gonna bore you anymore i will play music now please just get up tag along do something you don't have to finish a whole project you don't have to finish a whole room you don't have to achieve everything on your to-do list just get up and do something use me as your body double as your human timer this is just just a minute short of 30 minutes video 30 minutes even if you have to pause it and continue a few times you should be able to squeeze 30 minutes in a day and get some cleaning done so please just tag along and clean with me girl i see your face everywhere when i'm going out you'll be there because everything reminds me of you i can't take no more girl i think i'm losing my mind try to go to work but i lost track of time 
gon' keep looking like you I can't take no more I miss your touch From your hands and your body It hurts so much To think of you as someone else Can't get enough When you're sweet talking to me Now I'm talking sweet all by myself Put your arms around me Put your faith in me Put your love on me the clock and rewind go back to that moment in time when you say you want me for life was it all a lie i gave my all to deserve ya begging on my knees just to show ya you're the one i want and i love ya no 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 lie i miss your touch from your hands and your body it hurts so much to think of you as someone else can't get enough when you're sweet talking to me now i'm talking sweet all by myself put your arms around me put your faith in me put your love on me what you need from me need your love on me put your love on me i'ma do everything for you i don't want anyone but you put your arms around me put your faith in me put your love on me
should learn that on your own I play cool Cause I hope you pick it up soon And you know just what to do Don't you Boy, just be honest I 
wish I could make you stay Cause baby, I love you Why you tryna break us up When I'm tryna build it up I wish I could make you stop Cause baby, I love you Guess I'm gonna dance alone tonight I'm gonna miss your body You know I can never get it right Without you, no I don't wanna step into the light If I don't get you, shawty You bring out the sweetness of my life Oh yeah Come on and give me that, give me that, give me that good, good loving Come on and show me that, show me that, show me that you're the one I move to the left while you move to the right While you try to fight just Come on and give me that, give me that, give me that good, good loving Give me that, give me that, give me that, give me that Give me that, give me that, give me that, give me that Give me that, give me that, give me that, give me that Give me that, give me that, give me that, give me that good, good loving First you wanna come around Then you say you're leaving town Everything is upside down Oh baby, I love you
the nights I spend wondering why we couldn't be. Ooh. And now that you're alone, you're on my phone, running game. But maybe, baby, when it settles in that you're to blame, we could move on. Check for me. After I had folded half of the laundry, I thought I would use the remaining energy I had to actually go ahead and put it away. And I applied for both hours in our room and then the kids in their bedroom instead of leaving here for tomorrow to deal with it. I thought, no, no, do it now because you know what you're like. You'll just leave it and you'll stay there for days. So that's a huge achievement for me just there. And you will see in a second, I didn't finish our bedroom. I still have a huge mountain of clothes on the chair that needs to be done. And the 
few bags of mismatched socks and stuff that I'll finally, after months, empty out and go through them and see what needs to be discarded and what needs to be put away. But it is progress so far. As always, it was an absolute pleasure spending the day with you. This is what my bedroom looks like. Let's pretend there's just half the bedroom and the other half doesn't exist. See you tomorrow.